guys, did I tell you guys at the mall some boys were trying to talk to Analia in Can front of me? Analia kind of knows the girl that like I guess works there or runs there or whatever. So Analia's kind of embarrassed. Before jumping into today's video, I want to show you guys something I got from Amaro. They sent me their r3 sculpting machine i'm super excited to try it pretty much what it's supposed to do is sculpt your face under your eyes and your jawline i am so excited to try this you guys it literally comes in the cutest box we're gonna go ahead and unbox it with you guys first thing here is we have a cute note i've opened the card it's got a qr code on the back and then it says scratch off to reveal your exclusive discount code so you get a discount code and the front of it says thank you for choosing amaro and mark your beauty journey and unlock the transformative magic it holds we have another envelope with directions and information how to use the device and it comes with a charger to charge the device and then on this side dun 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 we have the actual device i am so excited to try this you guys so down here we have a really cute it's almost like a drawer i am loving this you guys on this side we have storage bags and we also get a maro hydrating moisturizing serum gel okay we get two of those and over here we get not one but two sets of this one is eye mask and for anti-wrinkle and firmness and then this one over here is for lifting the face and the neck mask oh i'm excited to try this all right guys i threw my hair up because i went and cleaned my face you're supposed to wash your face before you do anything so this is where we're gonna work our device okay so we're gonna go ahead and turn this bad boy on by pushing the power button here is all your buttons and indicators that you're gonna need Right now, we are in the intensive eye mode. Can you guys see that? The little indicator. It tells you here what it is. And then here is your little indicator that's lighting up. Can you guys see that? And if we press on the power button one more time, and we are now in the V-line lifting mode, which is pretty much lifting your jawline. And we're going to press it one more time. That is for the full face sculpting mode. These buttons here are an indicator of the intense mode. So it shows you here what level you're at. You can go all the way up to level five. For sensitive skin and sensitive areas around your eyes, it's recommended to use a very low intense level just because those are delicate areas. You don't want to go in heavy, especially under your eyes, which I think that's where I'm going to start because look at these bags. Like I have not had a good night's sleep in over a week. So we're going to start with the under eye. So I'm going to go ahead and put the eye mask on. Kind of cold. I guess I was expecting it to be cold though. I look like some kind of superhero. I'm actually, I'm actually, I'm actually liking this. Okay, I'm about to FaceTime Benny and be like, watch out. It already feels super good. Like, I love the cool feeling that it gives. I'm also a little scared that this is going to be painful, but I read that it's supposed to be really gentle on your skin. It's not even supposed to leave any red marks. I'm actually going to start off at level one since I am doing under my eyes. I'm going to start off at level one. I'm a little nervous, you guys. And we're going to start in the inner corner and work our way out. Oh, it tickles, you guys. It does not even hurt. It literally tickles. It's recommended that you do this for four minutes. You guys got to try this. There's no way that this doesn't work. Like, you guys are literally seeing it for yourself okay we're gonna go up to level two it still doesn't feel bad at all you guys i could definitely get used to just adding this into my night routine like you can feel it working because it tingles it doesn't hurt at all it literally just tingles like that's how i can explain it okay our time's up we done four minutes with that now we're just gonna let our mask sit another 10 minutes to try to soak in as much serum as we can we're gonna peel our mask off we're gonna rub in all of our serum and soak it in really good but now we're gonna try the v-line lifting mode aka the jawline and i know you guys have seen on some of my videos i have a double chin you guys like it's horrible i was actually don't tell anybody but i was actually thinking about getting lipo so i'm really hoping that this works for it because if this comes in clutch girl girl okay so for this one we're gonna start at level two and work our way up we're gonna go to town you always want to start at the bottom and work your way up because remember we're lifting i'm a little nervous that it's gonna feel funny it's very tingly but it doesn't hurt i'm actually liking how it feels we're gonna go up to level three scared me a little bit but it still does not hurt it's not painful at all it's literally 
it's a bunch of like tingles like i don't know how else to explain it like it's a bunch of tingles so this is also recommended to do for four minutes and just like the first one after the four minutes we're gonna let our mask sit for another 10 time to take our mask off and we're gonna rub in our serum because we want to soak it all in you guys playing with me because after the one use am i tripping or did my double chin kind of go away i know you guys seen in my other videos i have a big double chin and where did it go honey like, where is it at? It's not, I mean, I have a little one, but like, it used to be big, okay? So just one use, I personally feel like I see a difference. So now for the full face anti-aging mold, we're gonna go in with the hydrating serum and we're just gonna apply that right to our skin. This one's recommended to do for five minutes and we're just gonna go ahead on our bare face. And remember, we're always gonna go up because we wanna lift our face. We wanna look snatched, okay? We're gonna go in on our forehead because we need to get rid of some of those wrinkles. Okay, guys, so all in all, I am super satisfied. I love the product. I love the feeling that it gives. I, I personally feel like I can already see a difference in my skin. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. I personally love it. Obviously, it's not gonna get rid of my double chin to sculpt or lift my face with just one use, but I do believe with a couple uses, you would definitely be able to tell a difference. I'm super excited to add this into my routine. Also, if you have sensitive skin like me, I was super nervous that it was gonna hurt. It did not hurt at all. It was just the little tingles. And actually, at the end, it was quite relaxing. Also really excited to try it in the morning because sometimes when you wake up, you have puffy face, puffy eyes. I've seen reviews where people use the emergency facelifting mode and it literally brings the puffiness down within four minutes. Here's a before and after. You can see the lift right under the cheekbone and the jawline as well. I'll put the link in the description down below and also pin it in the comments so you can get yours before they sell out. Thank you, Amiro, for sending me the device and sponsoring today's video. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. We are finally home from our vacation and we had to snap back into reality. Everything was super crazy. It was so hard to like get back to our normal, going to school, picking the kids up from school, cleaning the house, cooking dinner, all that good stuff because you know when we're on vacation, we go out to eat like almost every single day because we don't have kitchens whenever we stay in hotels. So we're always out to eat. I'm not doing laundry. I barely have to clean because we have housekeeping so it was a real mission to like snap back into reality and start our lives again it's been almost what like five days since we got back it's been yeah it's been about five days since we got back and we're finally getting back into our normal routine right now i'm in the school line picking up benny from school it's currently two o'clock in the afternoon and Aliyah's with me because she did not go to school today because she was saying why, why didn't you go to school today um i don't know she asked if she could stay home and take a mental health day so i was like sure why not so that's well oh i'm lying i'm lying let me not lie to you guys i did not say sure why not i told her she had to go to school but then edward was like sure why not so here she is she stayed home today and then she went to work with me because if you guys don't know Analia, when she turns 18 she wants to buy and sell houses as well so she kind of just went to work with me which is not a bad thing you know that's a good thing too that way she's still learning when she's not in school but right now she's a little hangry so we're gonna pick up benny and then and I think we're gonna grab some lunch at Chipotle real quick. Viviana's texting me from school asking me if her friends can come over and stay the night tonight, which I'm okay with it. If you know me, you know that. I don't really like her staying at other people's homes. I'd rather her friends come to our home. Like our home is just the home for everybody to hang out at, I guess. And I actually really like that for us. I really like that for her. I really like that. Like I said, I'd rather them stay at our house than for her to stay somewhere else. So that way I kind of know what they're doing. Unfortunately, I'm not gonna be there tonight because I have a nail appointment at my friend's house and then we're just gonna hang out because my friend is my nail tech so we're probably just gonna hang out the rest of the night so she'll be home with edward and analia and her friends and benny and i don't know what they're gonna do they'll probably be like board games or something like that but for right now we need to get some lunch because i am starving you guys and i know she's starving because she's got a little attitude going on so we're gonna grab some food and we'll see you in a minute hey guys so it's been like two days later i have no idea what happened to the first video that we started vlogging i don't know what happened to the end of that so i'm just gonna add this with that video we're just gonna keep on vlogging for you guys right now so today is saturday and it's been a really really bummy day i don't think that we've had like an off day like this in a long time so and what i mean by like an off day like we're usually working or like we just always have yeah we always have something to do so i feel like this is like we haven't had just a chill day like this in a long time so i've been chilling at home we haven't even left the house and Aliyah, on the other hand she has been trying to get out the house she went and got ready today right on Aliyah, you ready to do something ready to go somewhere viviana how you feeling you chilling I'm tired tired how about you edward well i've been out the house already a few times but 
was a nice day today. So Benny's not with us because we were babysitting today and we have family members back at the house and Benny wanted to stay with the family members. So we're just gonna take him frozen yogurt home. But right now we're on a race because we are trying to get some frozen yogurt and they close in nine minutes. So we're trying to hurry up and get there before they close. And Analia kind of knows the girl that like, I guess works there or runs there or whatever. So Analia's kind of embarrassed because you never want to be that person that like walks in right before closing. It's right like here, you right? You don't want to be that person, yeah. And we made it, and we have like oh look, the four, open sign's still on. We have four yeah. minutes. Oh, and there's spare. three. There's three people in there, so we're good. All right, let's we're go. Good, we're good. We're good. Made it. I'm excited. You guys, I'm supposed to be on a diet, and this is me and Analia's second day in a row eating yum berry. Right, Analia? Me and you are supposed to be on a diet, and this is our second day in a row eating this. Yeah. What are you getting? Okay. They got a mango. Self one, and I have to get Benny one to go. Oh my god, Viviana, that's a lot. I mix them all. You're not even gonna eat all that. So I have uh, strawberry cheesecake. banana. No, I had New York cheesecake, strawberry, and chocolate. What do you got, Viviana? I'm gonna leave. Sorry. Chocolate, strawberry, and cherry. Okay. Can I, you give this one to Benny? No, he don't want that. He no, wants chocolate. It has chocolate. He just wants chocolate. No, listen. I just put Twix and I put um whatever that says that says help. So hope is that's heat. heat. What is heat? <laughs> that's a candy bar. Real quick, we're gonna show you what we got. I got vanilla yogurt with strawberry popping boba, strawberries, and mochis. You guys, mm. I have been obsessed with mochis lately. That's all I got in mind. It's pretty big. What'd you get? I got cheesecake, New York cheesecake, strawberry, and chocolate, and then I put cherry, chocolate chips, cherries, mochi. And uh, graham cracker. And caramel, is that caramel? Oh yeah, caramel, a little bit of caramel. Okay, what'd you get, Alia? I got um, cherry, chocolate, and strawberry at the bottom. What are those chocolate things? Are those chocolate chips? Oh yeah, and chocolate chips, and then chocolate turtles. I don't know, I think they have caramel. Caramel in them, in them I think. And then cherries. What'd you get, Viviana? I got some mango dough whip, pineapple dough whip, strawberries, one gummy bear, and that's it. Okay. And brownie. For Benny, all he asked for was chocolate ice cream with chocolate rocks. I didn't know what those were. I only had to help me find them. So this is what Benny got. We are on day three of this vlog. And right now we're at the mall because Viviana had gotten some stuff for from her birthday that she didn't like. She don't like the baggy look. And like everywhere is selling baggy clothes. She's not with the whole baggy shorts and the baggy pants. Right, Viviana? You're not with the whole baggy look? Every time it's cool, I, ha I have to I literally baggy. just woke up. I fell asleep in the car. Aww. Every time for my school uniform, I always have to wear baggy pants. Yeah. Viviana, how you doing? I always bumps on my pants. Oh, okay. Viviana, how people. you doing over there? Pretty good. Pretty good? How you doing? I'm okay. I'm just, I'm, just, it's, it's, I'm just going with the flow. Just okay. hanging out. I know, wants to go to TJ Maxx, so we need to go to TJ Maxx sometime before the night's over with. And then I need to go to Target, because I have some clothes from Target, too, that I need to return. Well, other than that, you guys ready to head in this and mall? guess what, guys? I have what? $9. Nine dollars. <laughs> Battle, here. All right, guys, so we just got home from shopping. We went to TJ Maxx, Target, the mall, and then we went out to eat. I'm gonna show you guys what we got real quick, and then I'm gonna pass it to Analia so she can show you guys. You guys, did I tell you guys at the mall some boys were trying to talk to Analia in I front of me? These and Go she, get was, you some samples. she was walking outside of Pandora with, let me see your bag. She cashed out at Pandora, you guys. So she she, she was walking outside with her Pandora bag. Cause she's got a bunch of mini bags, okay? She went, she like cashed out. Anyways, so we're walking outside Pandora and all of a sudden me and her are like next to each other, right? Like this. And then all of a sudden from behind us, I hear, yeah, 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 Pandora, Pandora, Pandora. But it was so weird because first, I don't know, some reason I just knew they were talking about Nalia. So like we're still walking and I, I didn't even look behind by the time I was like, 
Are they are they trying to talk to I you? I want there. She was like, yeah, just keep walking. Just, just keep, keep walking. walking. And there was like <laughs> the last time I went to the mall, I was so walking funny. by myself because my mom was getting my nails done because there's a nail salon in the mall, right? So my mom was getting her nails done. I was like, oh, I'm gonna run to go get a cinnamon real quick. I'll be back, right? I went, I walked to the cinnamon place. First of all, I looked ugly, so I don't know what they do. It was this dude, he walked past me, right? The and door. then pretend that, the pretend door. that you're, you're pretending that you walked past me. Walk past me, he's like, hey, beautiful. And then I was like, I was like, and I just kept walking. I would have went like, boom. I was like, um. So I'm like, married? so me and Emily are walking. We're walking next to each other like this, right? Nobody say you like her. She's married. And with the promise ring at though. They're no, like back not. here, like Pandora, a hey, Pandora, a hey, a. Hey. And there's like what three of them? There's like four. Like four of them. Three. The only reason I know that is because when we walked out of the store, I seen them through the corner of my eye. And then I'm like, Analia, are they talking to you? Like, are they trying to get your attention? And she was like, yeah, just don't look back and keep going, keep going. So then I was like, the nerve that they had, like you That's are so with your mother. Disrespectful boys. Yes, don't <laughs> do that. I hate that. And you know what else I hate? When people comment on my Instagrams or my TikToks, they're like, can I date your daughter? Can I date your daughter? Like, no boy, you can't date my daughter. No, she's married for one. For two, that's not how you know. Hell Did no. my nails eat? Anyways, Viviana got her nails done when we were at the mall. And then let me show you guys what I got so the girls can show you guys. So we're trying to go organic. So we're starting. Can I show what I got first? Cause I yeah, go ahead. I only want to show you guys first. Hold on. Okay, guys. I got at JD's. I JD's. got these pink. Oh, and this some other two boys, these little Edgars. We're trying to hit on Analia too. Mm. These pink Nike um sweatpants that go with my pink mm. Nike hoodie. So they I'm gonna talk and I'm gonna wear as like a tracksuit, right? And then at Target, I got these. I don't know why I've been wanting sweatpants really. I got these white cargo sweatpants. They cop. Cop? I think they're a little big, but it's okay. Cause I mean, we'll get you some. I think it's good sometimes. And then I got me this new foundation brush because I've been looking for one. And then I got me some rubber band hair And I finally found my freaking lip liner. You guys, literally everywhere I could not find my lip liner anymore. What's crazy is before I used to find it everywhere. Not to burst, not to like go high in my ego or nothing, but ever since I ever since I posted my lip tutorial video and it got like five hundred thousand views, it's going down. everywhere I've been going. Like I cannot find my freaking lip liner, so that's why I know lip size been looking. Literally, my lips have been looking so weird because I couldn't find my lip liner and I ran out. Um, and then I got a new bronzer because the bronzer I've been using has been okay, but not like that good. Um, what else did I get? And then from Pandora. I got me two of the same ones. I got me this little pink thing. It's like a divider of my uh, charms. And then I got me another one, another divider. Oh, this is my, this is um like a little travel bag, but it's pink, so I thought it was so cute. And then, and then this one is another divider. It's it the same one, but I think it would look so cute on my bracelet, guys. So I got all of those three from Pandora. So it's a big powder. I see it I put it in the freezer and it froze the whole thing because I forgot how to take it out. And then I got me and then I got me this Michael Kors purse, guys, that I thought was super cute. Look at the little strap. Do you guys think it's cute or no? I think it's super cute. So got me this. And yeah, that's everything that I bought today. I'm pretty sure, yeah. That's everything that I bought today, guys. So, I'm gonna go use the bathroom because I need to go pee in the bathroom. Fit check for the fist check. But don't mind my hair, it's nappy because, um, yeah, it looked better when it was on nappy. But I got this ni black Nike zip up hoodie. Okay, okay, preppy. Then I got these leggings. Um, these leggings. Then I got these black Uggs. And let me show you the outfit. Hold up. Watch out, Mom. This is the outfit. My eyelashes are eating. 
Her eyelashes are always eating, I feel like. Why are you lying? No, they You're really do. Eating? They <laughs> No, they always eat. She thinks that they don't, but they do. They always eat her eyelashes. Look, look at this. That's cute. No. That's like my favorite picture ever. No. Anyways, I'm, you guys. I'm dark. I'm gonna show you guys what. Different? Show you guys what I got from Target real quick. We're trying to become a natural household and trying to get rid of like all the chemicals and stuff like that. So we're gonna try out the native um, hair care. And I, we got shampoo and conditioner and for my bathroom. And then we got a shampoo and conditioner for the girls' bathroom, which this kind actually smells so good, you guys. So we got that one. And then I'm, you guys know we've been going to the gym. The other day I was in so much pain and everybody told me to start drinking more protein or eating protein, which I do eat a lot of protein, but apparently I need more, so I'm not in pain. So I got some of this Protein Premier, or Premier Protein, however it is. And then I found a recipe on TikTok that you eat it with um, oatmeal. And it gives you kind of like a, um, I don't know, like a, I don't know, it's supposed to fill you up and it's supposed to be really good. So I got this conditioner for Viviana because, oh, this isn't even conditioner, it's shampoo. I thought it was conditioner. <laughs> Anyways, I got it for her to shave her legs, but this is not Because my mom doesn't want to give me sh um, shaving oil. Um, it's shaving oil? You mean uh, shaving cream? No. Shaving, you don't even know what it's called. Shaving? No, mom. Yes, I do. Who doesn't know what shaving cream is? <laughs> Anyways, you guys, I got me some hair dye. Anyways, Because I need you, to, look, I'm getting old. You guys see those gray hairs? Go get you tree hut. Tree hut. Shaving oil is the best shaving oil you can ever get. Trust me. Trust. Shaving oil? Shaving, That's a thing? Yeah, shaving oil is bomb. Okay, and Aaliyah got her some chucks that she forgot to show you guys, I think, or did she show you guys already? If she didn't show you guys, she got some Converse. And then, over here, from TJ Maxx, I got myself some shoes, but honestly, I think they're gonna be too small. I think they're gonna be too small. I might have to take them back. And then I told you guys that I was super sore, so I got me a wooden roller so I could roll out my my muscles. And then Benny got a pair of shoes, which he wore these, so they're not in the box. He wore them to dinner. And then Edward got himself some Nike Panda Dunks. And then Benny got some Benny. Oh, look at Remy, guys. Remy got her, somebody wants to do a brand deal with me for a dog bed. So Remy's about to get an extra large dog bed. Bruh, anyway, so no, Benny got uh, some. That's no, but it's it's a big dog bed that people and dog can dogs can lay in. And her bed is in my room. She loves sleeping with Viviana. Anyway, so I got Benny these, and I guess I don't like them anymore, the kids' Air Forces, because they all have this. And I was like, why did they start making them like that? I don't like that. I mean, I guess it's easier for the kids to put on, but it looks, I don't know. Somebody, I don't like some them. boy right here, doesn't know how to tie his oh. shoe. Now Viviana's gonna show you guys what she got. I think about to start crying. I got this blush brush, because I only told me to get this. And I need a, a blush brush, because I use Analia's. And I got this spongy. Um, a super blender. I got some concealer, guys. I got this uh, starter one because I kind of forgot my shade. So, and Target didn't really have like the brand I get. So I just got this Fit Me one. I usually get the Elf, but it's okay. Revolution um blush, and um, not you guys care, but in the shade Lady Pink. Cute. No, I'm joking. I don't know what the shade is. I personally think powder blush stays longer than liquid blush. That's me. And I got some two packs of gum because you gotta have good smelling breath at school. If you don't have good smelling breath at school, or at least you better brush your tongue, get mouthwash, anything. Get some gum or brush your tongue or brush your teeth right so you can get a good breath. Um, yeah, so I got in the, the flavor mint. Oh, and I got this. Also, the concealer thing I got, I usually get um, Elf and I got Maybelline. Thank you guys so much for watching, and make sure you guys like, subscribe, turn your post notification bell on, and go watch our next video, because it's going to be fire. What's our next video? I don't know, but it's going to be bomb. <laughs> You're funny.
<laughs> Funny enough for you to give back my phone? No. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, everybody, go to my mom's TikTok. Go to my mom's YouTube. Comment. Give back to Diana's phone because she's in desperate need and she goes crazy without it. So everybody go comment, give back, or say justice for Viviana's phone. Say justice. Please, oh spread God. the word. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, turn the post notification bell, comment down below for my ideas that our family could do. And I'll see you guys in the next video. It's going to be bomb.com.